July 7, Psalm 92 It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to sing praises to the Most High. It is good to proclaim your unfailing love in the morning, your faithfulness in the evening, accompanied by the ten-stringed harp and the melody of the lyre. You thrill me, Lord, with all you have done for me. I sing for joy because of what you have done. O Lord, what great works you do, and how deep are your thoughts. Only a simpleton would not know, and only a fool would not understand this. Though the wicked sprout like weeds, and evildoers flourish, they will be destroyed forever. But you, O Lord, will be exalted forever. Your enemies, Lord, will surely perish. All evildoers will be scattered. But you have made me as strong as a wild ox. You have anointed me with the finest oil. My eyes have seen the downfall of my enemies. My ears have heard the defeat of my wicked opponents. But the godly will flourish like palm trees and grow strong like the cedars of Lebanon. For they are transplanted to the Lord's own house. They flourish in the courts of our God. Even in old age, they will still produce fruit. They will remain vital and green. They will declare, The Lord is just. He is my rock. There is no evil in him. Psalm 93 The Lord is king. He is robed in majesty. Indeed, the Lord is robed in majesty and armed with strength. The world stands firm and cannot be shaken. Your throne, O Lord, has stood from time immemorial. You yourself are from the everlasting past. The floods have risen up, O Lord. The floods have roared like thunder. The floods have lifted their pounding waves. But mightier than the violent raging of the seas, mightier than the breakers on the shore, the Lord above is mightier than these. Your royal laws cannot be changed. Your reign, O Lord, is holy forever and ever. Psalm 94 O Lord, the God of vengeance, O God of vengeance, let your glorious justice shine forth. Arise, O judge of the earth, give the proud what they deserve. How long, O Lord? How long will the wicked be allowed to gloat? How long will they speak with arrogance? How long will these evil people boast? They crush your people, Lord, hurting those you claim as your own. They kill widows and foreigners and murder orphans. The Lord isn't looking, they say, and besides, the God of Israel doesn't care. Think again, you fools. When will you finally catch on? Is he deaf, the one who made your ears? Is he blind, the one who formed your eyes? He punishes the nations. Won't he also punish you? He knows everything. Doesn't he also know what you are doing? The Lord knows people's thoughts. He knows they are worthless. Joyful are those you discipline, Lord, those you teach with your instructions. You give them relief from troubled times until a pit is dug to capture the wicked. The Lord will not reject his people. He will not abandon his special possession. Judgment will again be founded on justice, and those with virtuous hearts will pursue it. Who will protect me from the wicked? Who will stand up for me against evildoers? Unless the Lord had helped me, I would soon have settled in the silence of the grave. I cried out, I am slipping, but your unfailing love, O Lord, supported me. When doubts filled my mind, your comfort gave me renewed hope and cheer. Can unjust leaders claim that God is on their side? Leaders whose decrees permit injustice? They gang up against the righteous and condemn the innocent to death. But the Lord is my fortress. My God is the mighty rock where I hide. God will turn the sins of evil people back on them. He will destroy them for their sins. The Lord, our God, will destroy them. Psalm 95 Come, let us sing to the Lord. Let us shout joyfully to the rock of our salvation. Let us come to him with thanksgiving. Let us sing psalms of praise to him. For the Lord is a great God, a great king above all gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the mightiest mountains. The sea belongs to him, for he made it. His hands form the dry land too. Come, let us worship and bow down. Let us kneel before the Lord our maker, for he is our God. We are the people he wants watches over the flock under his care, if only you would listen to his voice today. 
The Lord says, Don't harden your hearts as Israel did at Meribah, as they did at Massa in the wilderness. For there your ancestors tested and tried my patience, even though they saw everything I did. For forty years I was angry with them, and I said, They are a people whose hearts turn away from me. They refuse to do what I tell them. So in my anger I took an oath, they will never enter my place of rest. Psalm 96 Sing a new song to the Lord. Let the whole earth sing to the Lord. Sing to the Lord. Praise His name. Each day proclaim the good news that He saves. Publish His glorious deeds among the nations. Tell everyone about the amazing things He does. Great is the Lord. He is most worthy of praise. He is to be feared above all gods. The gods of other nations are mere idols, but the Lord made the heavens. Honor and majesty surround him. Strength and beauty fill his sanctuary. O nations of the world, recognize the Lord. Recognize that the Lord is glorious and strong. Give to the Lord the glory he deserves. Bring your offering and come into his courts. Worship the Lord in all his holy splendor. Let all the earth tremble before him. Tell all the nations the Lord reigns. The world stands firm and cannot be shaken. He will judge all peoples fairly. Let the heavens be glad and the earth rejoice. Let the sea and everything in it shout his praise. Let the fields and their crops burst out with joy. Let the trees of the forest rustle with praise before the Lord, for he is coming. He is coming to judge the earth. He will judge the world with justice and the nations with his truth. Psalm 97 The Lord is King. Let the earth rejoice. Let the farthest coastlands be glad. Dark clouds surround him. Righteousness and justice are the foundation of his throne. Fire spreads ahead of him and burns up all his foes. His lightning flashes out across the world. The earth sees and trembles. The mountains melt like wax before the Lord, before the Lord of all the earth. The heavens proclaim his righteousness. Every nation sees his glory. Those who worship idols are disgraced, all who brag about their worthless gods, for every god must bow to him. Jerusalem has heard and rejoiced, and all the towns of Judah are glad because of your justice, O Lord. For you, O Lord, are supreme over all the earth. You are exalted far above all gods. You who love the Lord hate evil. He protects the lives of his godly people and rescues them from the power of the wicked. Light shines on the godly and joy on those whose hearts are right. May all who are godly rejoice in the Lord and praise his holy name.